load data from excel file to grid view in sp.net web page using c -sharp. start visual studio go to the file menu click on new project click on web sp.net web application name the web application i just put the name web application is excel to grid view select empty okay now the application is created first of all i have to add a well, spx piece web form add new item web form click on web form name the web form web form name is uh, export excel to grid view click on ok yes the spx page is created now i just added a div and uh, into the div i am adding a uh, heading tag heading is load data from excel to grid view i just import uh, excel data to grid view in asp.net c sharp okay now add one more div for uh, take, uh, for taking button and grid view okay now i'm designing the form with a link button and a grid view so uh, insert uh, row and column a table insert a table with a three row and one column yes it's done now add a link button control just uh, yes link button double click yes the link button control is added now change the text of this link button text is uh, load data from excel to grid view okay now add a grid view just double click to grid view yes the grid view is added now so change the weight of this grid view weight is 80 percent yes done now go to the button link button click event yes this is the link button click event first of all i'm creating a method to load data from excel to grid view so public void load data from excel to gb and string for this is the directory of the excel file and string extension extension is the excel file extension uh, and string hdr hdr is used to hdr uh, if hdr yes it will be treated uh, at the first row as header okay string con equal to configuration manager add system dot configuration namespace to use configuration manager and dot connection string dot connection string now in the double quotation i have to add connection string excel connection string first of all i have to create excel connection string okay under the configuration i am adding an connection string so add name equal to excel con and connection string equal to provider equal to microsoft dot s dot oledb dot 12.0 semicolon then data source data source equal to second bracket zero colon then extended properties equal to excel 8.0 and hdr1 okay my excel connection string is uh, created now just copy the connection name excel con and uh, paste it in the connection string okay it's done now now con equal to string dot format here call the connection string as next is con and file path file path is f path what i declared is string f path and hdr is hdr okay now oledb connection uh, to use oledb connection you should uh, add namespace using system dot data dot oledb and i declared uh, excel con equal to new oledb connection oledb connection connection string is con now excel con dot open now i just open the excel connection excel con dot open data table data table dt equal to data table excel dta equal to to use data table you should add space in system data excel dt equal to excel con dot 
get already be schema table dot already be schema guide okay dot tables null okay now string excel sheet it's used to get uh, first excel sheet of the excel file okay excel dta dot rows zero dot table dot to string okay it's done now where do we command where do we command is to select records from the excel sheet and it will load in the grid view so select command equal to new OLDB command select star from uh, third break and double quotation then plus sign then excel sheet name okay and initialize the connection string connection string is excel con okay now OLEDB data adapter di equal to new OLEDB data adapter select command okay now data table dt equal to new data table di dot fail dt to load data from excel file in dt so close the connection I going to close and then grid bound data choose equal to dt and grid bound dot data bind okay now in the button click event I just uh, write code to get file path directory so string uh, file p equal to server dot map path first of all I'm gonna create a folder in the directory in solution uh, with the name files and in this files folder I will put the excel file so let's uh, take the excel file uh, uh, just uh, copy the excel file and paste it in the files folder in the solution okay the file is added now for the directory first of all solution sign and then backslash then file name is files folder name is files and uh, file name is student information dot excel so just copy paste okay now call the method load data from excel to gb my parameters is f path so file path is f, uh, uh, f path and then extension is dot excel sx and uh, is sdr is yes is there used to cheat as uh, the first uh, row is header row okay now these are the records in the excel file and uh, or, uh, yes uh, semicolon okay now go to the view in browser right click and go to the view in browser yes load data click on load it oh table does not belong to tables okay the error is in table so change this text uh, this is the uh, table underscore name with capital letter table underscore name yes now right click view in browser again load data yes it successfully loaded the records from the excel sheet to grid view you can see student id name address age contact uh, and uh, as same as in the excel file student id name address age and contact now i'm gonna show uh, how to add file upload control and how to load data any excel file using file upload control so i just uh, take a file upload control from the toolbox and in the code just uh, write some code code is if file upload one file upload one is file upload one controls id file upload one dot hash file then string file name equal to path dot get file name to use path you should add new spaces in system dot iu and file name to get file name just to write code file upload one dot first dot file dot file name okay now string file path file path equal to server dot map path path is files folder it's always from files folder and then file name okay 
file upload on dot save as save as file path first of all if you want to load any uh, file first of all it will save in the files folder then it will display um, from the solution this is the system okay now browse select uh, student information open yes it's displaying and the file or uh, uh, student information dot is also saved in the files folder you can see uh, now I'm gonna show one more Excel file yes desktop uh, CCTV files click on open now in the files folder there is no file excel file but when i lo uh, click load data it's displaying the records from the excel file you can see the cctv files uh, excel file also saved in the files folder the solution okay thanks for watching this tutorial